Good morning and welcome back again. This is our third night in Hoi An and I'm struggling because I really like Hoi An and I was thinking about it last night and I don't know what it is I like. The only thing I can think of is everything's like just a little bit less. Like look at quick turn around lease over the river. So we, we've got tourists We've got bikes, we've got vendors, but there seems to be less there. And now listen, I cannot hear any horns. I haven't set this up. There's no horns. Normally there's always horns. There's no horns here. Look, there's no horns. So I think, I think it's just dialed down with the people a little bit. I think the noise, is, that was the first horn. <laughs> it's dialed down with the noise a little bit. And we've just come from a vendor and he goes, would you like a, a ride around the lake, sir? And I go, no, thanks. And he goes, half hour. I said, mate, I'm right. He walked Stopped. off. Yeah, no more hassle. <clears throat> uh, Lisa wanted a foot massage the other day. A and she's, oh, we just got here. We need to get some food. And the young girl goes, well, you come back and I look after you. And Lisa goes, yeah, yeah, yeah when I come back. And we're going to go back. And last night, which I couldn't believe, we are coming back from that food we had and it was lovely there. A guy in a restaurant stopped me. He goes, oh, sir, come in for dinner. And I said, mate, I've just eaten. He said, "Okay, oh, no worries, maybe tomorrow night. And th th I haven't had that in the 18 days. We've so I, I, I don't know why people love who I am. I think I do too. And I just think it's it's still Vietnam. We've still got the old buildings. We've still got the polluted rivers. We have the vendors. We have the bikes. We have, it just seems to be just dialed down a little bit. And again, there's no horns, so I don't know. I can't describe it. Hoi An is lovely. The food also seems to be next level. We've had some boudin stuff and it's been wonderful. But every meal we've had here so far, so I, so I don't know why I like Hoi An so much, but I am. And look, for me, we've got some grey skies and maybe we're gonna have a bit of rain. So I know good tourists, would be dreading this, but I'm loving Not this. so good tourists. Okay. <laughs> We're not so good tourists. Uh, so this is just by far my favourite province so far. And I thought I was going to miss out because Da Nang, the hustle, the bustle, the modernness, which I love too, but yeah. And a few people have told us, you fall, and you said I was going to fall in love yeah. with Brian, and I, I, Honestly, I, I'm, I'm, I know I'm talking, but I, I cannot explain. I just feel so relaxed here. I just feel like the actual whole day started. I feel as if I can zone out. And this is our third day. We're here for seven, three have already gone. Yeah, so it's gone so quick. So the time is quick. just getting sucked from us. So yeah, look, Hoi An, so far, my far by favorite, absolutely beautiful. And I really don't know why, because it's Vietnam in so many ways, but yeah, wonderful place. Um, all right, so the only other thing I suppose that we need to mention today is um, the restaurant, the uh, home, the owners, the hotel where we're staying, they've got a restaurant and it's an Asian fusion. So we're really at least getting the duck tonight and I'm getting the beef tonight. So yep. me being the foodie I am, uh, really looking forward to that experience. And so the head chef has over 20 years experience among Ha Long the Halong Bay yeah. boat tours and cruises. Yeah. So he's brought that back to Hoi An. Yeah. So we're looking forward to looking it. Forward to and another thing too, and to be honest, I didn't really want to stay in this small boutique hotel. I didn't, because I like disappearing mm. and going to my room and being left alone. Because if you don't know already, I hate people. And when I heard Lisa had been speaking to Matthew so much, I thought they may have been in your face a little bit too much, and I thought maybe they would have been wanting to know our whole life story. That I think they've got that amount of um, measurement exactly right, where, you know, they're making our breakfast, they Come say, say good morning, have a great day. I say which way is the beach. They say go that way, and then they disappear. So yeah, coming into it in the taxi, I was a little bit. Oh, I don't know this boutique. I, I don't want them in my face. I don't want them in my life. But that didn't even eventuate as well. So yeah, look, show the streets, Bubba. Yeah, so here we are, beautiful Hoi An, um, and there's still no horns, and the streets are empty, but there's plenty of people. Because everyone's got their own space, hey? Yeah. And, and everywhere else there's, you know, the plastic chairs and there's scooters on the street. 
Now, I've done that for 18 days, and I enjoy that. Just seeing it missing, the absence, sometimes less is more. It's maybe the absence of all the bikes and all the tourists and, and all bustle. the noise and the... I mean, it's just amped up. But it is lovely. I just... Yeah, I, I'm done. That's all right.